Hi guys! How are you all? Kamusta kayong lahat? And this video, I'm going to share with you our uh, how to fill out the report of marriage to be sent in the Philippine Consulate General in Houston. So, yeah. So, me and my husband went to the bank to notarize our four copies of report or four original copies of our report of marriage to be notarized so it needs to be notarized guys you have you and your husband must be there or needs your presence to order for your papers to be signed by the lawyer or um uh, someone who notarized your paper we didn't pay in the bank it's free all we have all we did was to sign our to sign or fill out the form there or in the um, logbook that you have to the date you have to sign the date your name and your uh, what is the purpose and yeah before we dive in I have to clarify with you guys that I am not a lawyer this is based on my experience and I'm just want to share with you with that being said in the blank page you are going to write or type down the information before you get married so this is my husband information and the wife information so the last name of my husband is Ryder first name Timothy middle name is John so the date of birth must be the date first months and the year and for the place of birth must be city, states, on slash province, so Dallas, Texas, USA. So civil status, single, citizenship, American, naturalized, so in A, wala siya, so religion, Methodist. So in my side, so Bacolando, my last name. A first name Anneli, middle name Ingel, birthday November 1, 1989, place of birth Davao City, Philippines, civil status single, Filipino, um, and A and Pentecostal. For the details of a foreigner, a foreign marriage, so date of marriage, so the date first, month, and July. Name of the witness one, Mary Joy Richardson. And name of officiating, so William D. Landy. Place of marriage, Gainesville, Texas, USA. So the second witness, Stephen Davis. So the details of ascendant that my, um, my husband's parent, parents. John Calvis Ryder, citizenship, American, Judy Abbott Davis, the mother's na maiden name, citizenship, American, so in my side, my dad's name, Dodimo Damior Bacolando, citizenship, Filipino, my mother's name, Alicia Humanda Ingel, citizenship, Filipino so as you can see here number 20 I we under uh, undersign declare under penalty of perjury under the law of Republic of the Philippines that the information I have provided here are the true and accurate facts of a marriage being sought to be registered to the best of my knowledge so you are not going to sign until you get in the lawyer or when you arrive or the lawyer needs to be seeing you both husband and wife so bring blank or use blank ink to be signed here and this must be signed with the lawyer or um, someone who would notarize your paper and right here should be where the 
um, sealed, not sealed, like, yeah, stamped by the lawyer. And this part here, do not sign. Because this would be the Philippine Embassy Consulate would write something here. So basically, this is what um, my my form look alike like all the capital letters but except on this because when you type it it would write goes right like this so i hope you guys learn or give you some information of what you need so good luck and thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe my youtube channel